Let's have a look over here first. My staff was for the golden stables again. Can't help you there, bud. Very good, to East Pool. Leave him in the park. Ooh, obelisk. Here, has this thing always been glowing? Oh, uh, possibly. Could also have been me. Have a look up here. Oh, scarecrow! Why does that scarecrow look like a tomberry? There's one missing. Not sure how I feel about that. Tomberries! I wonder if there'll be any tomberries in this game. Oh, we got an orchestral roll. Nice. Will be bridges down. If you're headed for East Pool, right. you'll have to wait. I was supposed to be in East Pool yesterday. Is there anything here that may be of use? Nope, it's not. Doesn't hurt to look. Nice day to do your washing. Yeah. Be on you like a rash. Where I don't think my master would be very happy about that. <laughs> Maybe next time. <laughs> Goblin coin. You ain't pulled that sword from its scabbard in days. Come on, come inside. Uh, I'll be happy to show you how well I wield my blade. After my shift's over. <laughs> Don't be getting frisky in town. Hey, hey. Oh, Sparky. Come and have a look. Don't be shy. Fresh cut, fresh cut. Oh, this we could actually do. to do that right now I don't think. I think that's going to be like a continuation of something else. I don't know. I am not finished searching this area yet. But at least we know that that is an elevator. Was not expecting that. Oh look at all that delicious meat. Oh look at those delicious vegetables. Oh, look at it all. Oh. Been doing healthy trade with the folk from the Monastery of Late. Funny how Grega's servants always seem to have full purses. Interesting. Make sure you're aiming that at the fish there, son. Keep them nice and fresh. Oh, that's cool. Hello. Anything catch your eye? Probably not, because I think I've got everything. Yeah. Goodbye now. Can't afford that. I need a lot Take more money. Out there, eh? I need a lot of monies. Did you hear the latest from Del Mechia? Toy no. spat with Shiva. Crusaders didn't stand a chance even with an icon. Is that what they're saying? Okay. We go this way. That's so cute. I don't know. Oh, it's a is that chocobo? It's a chocobo. This place is nice. I like it. Hello.
Excuse me. Would you happen to be the landlady? Depends who's asking, and why they have an Imperial bearer with them. For protection, which hopefully won't be needed, if you can advise me on the safest route to the west. It's your friend here I'd be worried about. Bearers don't have an easy time of it in Rosaria. Even a strapping lad like him might attract the wrong kind of attention. And if he gets nabbed, it ain't likely to end well for you either. Then we'll just have to stay out of the militia's way. Gav said you might be able to help us. Follow me. Okay. Sorry for before. Can't be too wary of strangers asking questions in our game. I'm Martha, an old friend of Sid's. I'm Clive, a Has new friend of Sid's. For a bearer who joined recently. I expect that's you. So, where is it you're headed? For Phoenix Gate. We have questions that need answering. Is that so? Well, if you want to avoid the garrison, the road through Eastpool's your best bet. Or it would be, if the bridge hadn't collapsed. A right blooming nuisance it is. We've had no trade with the village for weeks. I did ask our carpenter to take a look at it. But he went out on another job. And he hasn't come back. Do you think something might have happened to him? Fingers crossed he's just taking his time. The alternative don't bear thinking about. We'll find him. And make I sure smell a quest safe. coming on. <laughs> we both need that bridge repaired. Your carpenter sounds like the man to do it. I see why Sid's got such a soft spot for you. If you could, I'd be in your debt. Oh, thanks. You said that he went out on a job? Right. He went down into the marshes to check on another bridge. The one by the fallen gate. The marshes were dangerous at the best of times. We should hurry. There's a ladder to the side of the gate. That's the quickest way down, if you've a head for heights. His name is Bernard. Should you find him well, tell him Martha sent you, and that he's wanted at the bridge to Eastpool. Quest accepted. Building bridges. Now this is a red one, it's not a green one. So it's a quest within a quest? Pretty much. Are you going any to the marshes then? Let's find that ladder. Yeah, in a minute, I gotta look for things, you know. Right, let's go tour ye. It was good, honest work building the aqueduct. Sure it was think about pressing on. Alright, alright. Just let me get this down, mate. I can't be seen talking to you. If there's anything you need, ask Martha. Uh, okay. I don't need it. It's okay. I don't know if we should go out that way. Sorrow wise. Uh, see, I don't want to go out that way and have it be like a big area. Hmm. You know what? Let's let's go have a sure you're quick look. Come and have a look! Don't be shy. I'm not shy. I just got better things to do. But yeah, we'll just we'll, we'll walk out a bit until we get more on the map and see what happens. I mean, it looks like a pretty big area. What? Is that chocobos over there? Oh, lad. What's up? I have one. I don't know where he is. That's a good point. What happened to Ambrosia? She's still alive? Is quite a big area actually. It doesn't look like we can get to any of it. 
but that was the wrong one. We're obviously going to go and have a explore. A little exploration. Get him double. Damn, girl. You are badass. It's a turtle. It's a giant turtle. I don't think he's friendly, though. It's an Adamant toys? Really? <laughs> It's so tiny. It's just a freaking turtle. happened there? Oh, he's shooting the old things at me. Oh. It's so tiny. I'm inside it. <laughs> it's squishing me, but it's not squishing me. Hello, hello. Peekaboo. Ah, uh, peekaboo. <laughs> Boo. Okay, just no, just no. That's pretty funny, actually. Oh. Yes. Gonna explore this area. Oh, there's another one. Oh 
Grab this wherever it is. Head in this direction. Get them all? We did get them all. What's that there? Small crabs by the looks of it. Keep your distance, boy. That's it. Level up. Nice. Oop. I don't know what that jump is all about. Just for fun. Alright. We should be getting a lot of components for making things. Okay. Oh wait, is he these these aren't friendly? These aren't friendly? Why are these not friendly? Not there, boy. Oh, I thought these were friendly! I feel like a douchebag right now. Other oh, wild chocolates. We can fight wild chocolates? That's different. Bro, where did you get that? Cool shield. I want that. How do I get that? Give me your shield. I want her shield. Oh, it's a church. Wademund Abbey. Definitely feels like this is maybe a place we're gonna come later. a lot of that magic dash not complaining I'm sure we're gonna use it for something what I do not know hello did they come back Jokables came back. Oh no, because we went the other side, didn't we? That's right. Is that you making that noise? What is this? Uh, just some ruins. Oh, 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 excuse me, spitters. I'm busy. That's a 
has it easy, Z girl. Don't worry about it. So we've got like one little area to do. And beat those uh wild chop as well. So give us more experience. Let's go. Oh wait, these ones are not ones to attack? I'm so confused. I don't know what's good and what's bad anymore. That one's maybe a bad one. Maybe. Let's go. Let's follow this route round. This way. Are you friendly? You're not friendly. Okay, so some of them are friendly and other ones are not friendly. It's very confusing. Very confusing. I'm sorry, little dudes. I did not mean to hurt you. Same time, candidate. isn't too bad. Doesn't look like there's much more here. Oh, that's where we were over the other side, I think. Yeah. Oh, there's another one of them. Deal with him in a minute. He's a big boy. Go get this big guy, and then we should be done in this area. So we clearly can't go this way right now. Probably we'll be able to later. Let's knight him over there. You know what to do. Yeah. 
there where is that we went there already do I just respawn maybe actually because I definitely went over there all right so I'm thinking if we do perfect so we can fast travel in the local menu or local map All right, let's see. We want to go this way now. Ready goes to eat. Here's the gate, and that must be the ladder. That we already. Oh yeah, look, there's other items down there that I already picked up. I see. I don't care what your orders are, Brandon. Ah, get away from me! What was that? It came from under the bridge. Come on. We got this, we got this, we got this. We got this. Company. There he is. Hold on, we're coming. Don't let them get away. Ugh. Give them all you've got for them. It's over. In for you. Yeah. Enemies. Thank you, my lady. You saved my life. It was Not me. at all. You're Bernard the Carpenter, yes? I am. I, I didn't realize my name was known so widely. I'm a friend of Martha's. She asked us to come and find you. Well, I'm very grateful for it. I just finished checking these piles when I turn around, I see a gang of slavering monsters looking to, to feast on my flesh. If you hadn't come when you did, <laughs> so dramatic. I'd have been snipped into strips by now. We're just glad you're safe. Well, I, I best go and give my regards to the landlady then, hey? Actually, she asked that if we found you, we should beg you make haste to repair the bridge to Eastpool. Of course. I said I'd take a look at it, but it clean slipped my mind. I'll head up there straight away. Oh, the trusses are still sturdy. It's just a matter of replacing the stringers and relining the deck. I'll have it done in no time. Thank you, Bernard. We were hoping to take the road to Eastpool ourselves. We're very grateful for your help. And sorry for asking this of you after what you've been through. I owe you my life. Fixing a bridge is the least I can do. Thank you, my lady. And you too, son. You're welcome, You're with buddy. Sid, ain't ya? Me and him will go way back. Not as far as Martha mine, but far enough. I see. Well, I best get cracking then. You go and let Martha know I'm all right, and she'll have her bridge back soon enough. We will. All right. Port back to Martha. The bridge will be fixed when it's fixed. It will be fixed when it's fixed, indeed. I hear the levers are due to your own. Do you like that? I'm back. Ooh, good honest work building the aqueduct. 
on dressing greens of Kisau. One never down raw, lest bitter juices inspire violent retching and loose spells. Lovely. Two, avoid the frying pan. Lest foul stink taint the iron, rendering its it none better than slag. Three, by no means put to stew, lest the vapors over excite stable boars. If suffer the fodder, one must first mix with nine parts drake's mint, six parts lemon peel, and three parts ginger root, and soak in honeyed wine for a quarter moon to lessen malador. Lovely. The falling cheery will be repaid with a swift boot to the arse. Wait, what? <laughs> Mucking, stacking, packing, peeking, palming, foisting, fingering. <laughs> okay then. Bisky. Alright, I'm done. Is there anything else to look at in here? I don't think I saw anything else. But you never know. You talking to me? I will press on when I'm done. you're back what happened did you find bernard we, we did. did he's fine and he'll have the bridge to eastpool repaired soon oh, well thank the founder for that it was lucky we found him when we did the creatures out there are not to be trifled with it's the blight's fault they had nothing to eat in the north so they come down here hunting for food he can't keep going out alone i'll have to arrange a guard for him but anyway thank you I don't have a lot to offer in return, but you're welcome to rest here until the repairs are finished. We'd be delighted. Sounds good. Quest complete. Building bridges. Did we get anything for us all? Meteorite. Can I get you a drink or anything while you wait? Flagon of Imperial Gold, perhaps? Tastes like swill, but it'll slake a thirst. No, thank you. I prefer the truth about why there are so few bearers around here. Yes, there were more of them when we were young. Far more. Is this the Empire's doing? Have they been sent away? Either to the legions or Auriflam. Seems the miners at Drake's Head are having a hard time keeping up with demand of late, so the bearers make up the shortfall. Time was they used to dole out crystals like sugar plums even down here in the provinces, but not anymore. Nowadays they'll jump at any excuse to confiscate our bearers so they can be put to work elsewhere. I always knew the Empire treated their branded like shit, but after seeing it with my own eyes, well... Ah, Thea! Congratulations on the new arrival. And you got the little laddie with you? It was a bearer. The boy I carried for nine long moons. A bloody bearer. Oh, you poor thing. You gave it to the constables then. Just left it at the garrison. I let them deal with it. Couldn't wait to be rid of the blasted thing. Been wanting it gone since the moment I found out. Well, it's all dealt with now. So no harm done, eh? Mum, you weren't my brother, was he? No. But you'll have one soon enough. You just have to be patient. Oh, right. my goodness. <sighs> Unbelievable, isn't it? Bearers may have been looked down on back in Archduke Elwyn's day, but they were still human beings. Now they've fallen so far, a beggar wouldn't spit on them. Since you're not drinking, do me a favor and take that to the Abbey. There's a darkness, the heart of this world, and I'd have you see it. Hmm. 
and we'll see it at an abbey. Glademond Abbey, on the shore of Sorrowise Bay. We're talking the about Abbey is, is there, and there's Tell no darkness. And he'll show you what I mean. Understood. Quest accepted. A bear's lot. Yeah, we were just there and there was nobody there. Oh, I didn't get any obelisks over there. Oh, I don't even think there was any. Make sure you're aiming that at the fish there, son. Come and have a look. Don't be shy. Fresh but we won't fight anything. We'll just run straight there since we know where it is. Right, the chocolates. That would save us a lot of time. That a bear is fate was decided at birth. And assumed it was best for all concerned. I know. But for a child to be blamed. To be hated by its parents through no fault of its own. We knew nothing of what it meant to be born that way. Did we? No, because none of us were born as bearers. But there's a question. How did they know they were going to be bearers? Hmm. Okay, fine. If you're going to drag me into a fight, we're going to just have to fight. Before I got other things to do. Did we get? Let's go. Is the Abbey. What darkness awaits us within, I wonder. What is that? Let's go and see. Oh. It's a spider is a part of something else. <laughs> I'm sorry, what is that? You'll find out what the darkness is. Good day to you. I'm afraid the Abbey is not open for public prayer. May Grieger go with you? We came to offer a donation. From Martha. <sighs> I see. Then please, follow me. I don't know if we should follow him or not. I... I don't want to die. Please, Father. Something for the pain. I beg you. The light. Your fate. I don't want to die alone. What's wrong with them? It's all right. I'm here. Who are these people? Martha's bearers. She entrusted them to my care, that I might ease their suffering. To the extent that I can, for the time they have left. But what happened to them? Or what is happening to the them? The curse has taken them. All of them. As it does every bearer forced to use their gift. With each draw on the ether, 
their bodies petrify, till oh. all that remains is stone and pain, and so they are cast aside. There is nothing either Martha or I can do to change that, but we can at least strive to make their final hours a little more bearable. <laughs> Have faith, my son, for you shall rise again and find the happiness denied you in this life. Thank you, Father. Is that going to happen to Clive? I must offer you my own thanks for the medicine you so kindly brought. Now their final moments may be moments of peace. Oh. That affected Jill pretty badly. When next you see Martha, pray tell her that two more have succumbed. So is that the darkness she was talking about? Makes sense. We should get back to Martha's rest. Yes. We should. You okay, girl? Wanna talk about it? Pretty sad, eh? Okay. That is not the one I wanted. That is the one I wanted. We're back. It was good, honest work. Ah, you're back. Thanks for taking care of that. The abbot had a message for you. Two more have succumbed. I see. Come upstairs. Oh, we're gonna have a secret chat. So, now you know, eh? I've seen plenty of bearers die on the battlefield. But never like that. And all because they were born different. The powers that be can't take away their gift, so they strip them of their humanity instead. Oh, there's plenty who pity a bearer's plight. But so long as we're content to sit around, weeping for those on whose broken backs we're carried, we ain't gonna change nothing. And so you lend Sid your strength. What little of it I have. Used profits from this place to buy the poor buggers. So when the abbot told us the bearers were yours? Aye. They're my property. At least by law. Any still fit to work fetch a price beyond my means. All I can do is care for those who are past mending. But it's not all doom and gloom. Bernard's finished fixing that bridge for you. You can carry on to Eastpool now. You've got questions that need answering, ain't you? Well, I wish you luck. Thank you, Martha. Oh, I almost forgot. Sid and I have other friends in Rosaria. Wear this and they'll know you for one of us. Oh, so you've obtained slumbering charcoal. Cool. And know that you will always be welcome here. Thank you. I'm sure we'll see you again. You were right, Sid. It really is them. Lord Rosfield and Lady Warwick have come back to us. Ah. Uh. And long may they stay.
So she isn't part of their family. I thought so. That just confirmed it for us. Oh, we got another two guild bugs. Still have to figure out where to sell them. Make for East Boo. Sid. Ah, oh, Clive. You're not worried. What I is that? You. Hurt your hand. I did, I. With a thousand little lightning bolts. Can't fling them around the way I used to. Think of it as my decoration for long service and exemplary misconduct. Okay. <laughs> You should stop smoking, bud. Bad for you. But you didn't come here to compare war wounds. We didn't. Thank you, Sid. For everything. <laughs> if you want to leave, that's your lookout. I'm sure you'll have a long and happy life together if you stay out of my way. <laughs> Sid! <laughs> oh. <laughs> I knew a girl back in the day. She was a slave to her fate, just like you. To save her. Is he talking about Benedicta? For a while, I even thought I could. But just because you think something doesn't make it true. Sid. I'm no savior. Just a conceited old fool. I talk about people forging their own futures. But instead of handing them the hammer, I beat them with my own. And if no bugger wants to listen to what you've got to say, you might as well keep your gob shut. But Clive, I will say this. You're not a monster. You're the same man you've always been. Accept that, and you may yet escape your fate. My fate? Look, lad, you've had a hard life. And I don't see it getting much easier. Thanks. You might not be able to save anyone else. But at the very least, you can save yourself. <laughs> Try. And Jill. I'm sorry we didn't get a chance to talk, but I trust you'll take good care of the boy. Yes, I will. Is that the last of it? Aye. We'd best head back then. I wouldn't want to keep Nan waiting. Hi. See you next time, Sid. We'll be back at the hideaway soon anyway. Well, maybe not. Holding on. My new quest is available. There. Right there. I have to find him before the Imperials do. Hello? Can't talk now, I... Oh, you're Clive, aren't you? Yes, Martha I am. Martha told me all about you. Word is, you're a devil with that blade. You look like you're in a hurry. Where are you going? Not far, I hope. But I dare not waste a moment. It might cost a man his life. Sounds serious. What happened? 
Not so much what happened as what might. They've discovered he's a bearer, see? And now, one of his erstwhile friends and neighbors wants to see him clapped in chains. Where is this bearer? He wasn't fool enough to wait for the Imperials to arrive. Poor sod took to the road, left his whole life behind. But they'll be after him before long. I need to find him and get him to safety, fast. Here. If you've the time and the inclination, I could do with a hand. Will you help me find him? Of course I will. Of course. That's what I live to do. We bearers have to look out for each other. Thank you, Clive. With your help, we might catch up with him yet. His name's Norris. We need to find him and get him to Martha before the Imperials sniff him out. You found him yet? You won't catch a bastard standing around clucking like old ends. That fucking snake played me false, acted like he was one of us, and the whole time he was one of them. We need him caught and handed over to the Imperials. Hanging's too good for him. Well, go on then. If he gets away, I'll see you fitted for a noose. All right, Ronald. We were just leaving. Look, this one's here to help. I was just filling him in. Send a bearer to catch a bearer, is it? Not bloody likely. That's it. I'll find the bastard myself. Come on now, Ron. It's dangerous out there. We wouldn't want you to come to any harm. You want something done right? You don't send a bearer. Clive, this might take a while. You start hunting our man, and I'll be along once I put Ronald's mind at ease. Someone said they saw Norris heading for the Fallen Gate. Maybe you could ask if anyone over that way knows anything. We have to find him. Don't let him slip through our grasp. Rest accepted. False friends. But as a bearer, I feel like I should I let the bearer go. Ronald takes matters into his own hands. Mm. There is a hardly difficult to spot. What did he mean about being played false, I wonder? Let's grab this one. Here, you're that bearer who works for Martha, aren't you? Can you give me a hand? Curse my luck. I dropped my crystal off a cliff into the bloody swamp like an utter fool. <laughs> now, I've not got your knack, see? And I need that shard to chill my fish if I'm to take him to market. But it's just a short climb down. I'll make it worth your while. Uh, okay. I can't promise anything. Well, just promise you'll look. Ah, there may be one thing I failed to mention about the crystal. A creature might have already claimed it. Claimed it? All right, eaten it, but, but, but only <laughs> might have, you understand. There were a lot of bog crabs down there. Nasty buggers, them. <sighs> Sounds like I need to break a few shells. Mm -hmm. Oh, don't worry, there, there, there weren't too many of them. A veritable walk in the marsh, as they say, the ladders, right over there. Crystalline lifeline. Okay. Uh, let's see if there's any more. Oh, there's another one up there. Um, I think we'll do these two first though, because that kind of seems like it's on the route that we're taking. Um, we do this one first. No, actually, let's go do this bit first. Let's see what it says. see one. Oh! Right in front of me! Are you him? Or are you someone else? You don't know a man called Norris, do you? I do, as it happens. He ran off that way not too long back. Looked like he was in a right all hurry. And he had a lantern with him for some reason. Never known him to stay out after dark. He was making for the marshes then. All right. Thank you. Thanks, buddy. I think he's gone over that way, so let's quickly knit back. Sorry, sorry, guys. I mean to ram into you. Just happened. Just happened. Right, let's go do this one first. How did you get down here so quick? Magic. 
is magical. Okay, I didn't mean to do that. I thought that was going to end badly. <laughs> it could have ended badly. Uh, maybe they just like the shiny things. Don't let them get away. You know what to do. Damn, Torgi. Did we get it? I think we got it. Alright, let's go back up and see him. And then we'll head on to the marshes. Assuming there's nothing else to do. Don't want to talk to you, bud. You always have something rude to say. Well, any luck? Yours, I presume. Power crystal. <laughs> Is it yours, buddy? You found it, oh, thank you. You're welcome. Oh, that's cool. Keeping the fish nice and cold. Any longer out in the sun, and my catch would have made for poor eating indeed. Be more careful next time. <laughs> oh, I will, I promise. No point casting my nets of a morning if I'm without a crystal to see the catch to town. There was a time honest taxpaying folk could get new ones whenever they wanted. Can't now, though, not for love nor money. Crystals are scarce, and the Empire tightens its purse strings more every day. Lose this little beauty again, and I might as well scrap my nets and take to begging. <laughs> okay. Yeah, a decent amount of money for some of these. I mean, all we did was run down a ladder and. Life without my crystal. crystal. Don't thinking about. You saved my livelihood, and no mistake. Okay. Catch you later, dude.